What's up guys, this is iTweets here, and today I'm going to be showing you a new tweak called Weatherboard. Now, Weatherboard is a really cool tweak. What it gives you is these weather-themed dynamic wallpapers. So you can actually see particles moving around in the background right there, and this theme is called Hurricane. So there's stuff moving around back there, and it's actually easier to see if we go to the lock screen. So you can see everything moving in a circular motion, and it looks really cool. Now there's a whole lot cooler ones other than this one, but let's go ahead and jump into our settings here, and I can show you exactly what those look like. Now there's actually 80 of these, so you can see first thing you need to do is enable this, and it will require a respring before you can actually set a wallpaper, but you also have your condition of your wallpapers. So there's 80 different wallpapers, and each of them have a daily condition as well as a nightly condition, so either day or night. So you can see here we have tornado on night as well as tornado on day. So if we jump into the night, you can see it gives you a preview before you set it. And it's kind of hard to see the particles in this particular theme, but you can see exactly what that does. Now, one of my favorites is the severe thunderstorm. As you can see right here, it's got that nice heavy rain going in a slant right there. And you'll also see this awesome lightning every once in a while strike through right there. And that looks really good on the lock screen as well as the home screen so we're gonna set this to the uh, we'll set this to the home screen here and we're gonna scroll down and just show a few more of these so we have a light drizzle and I'm gonna kinda go through these quick because there's 80 of them and I don't have time to show you all 80 but you can see kinda what these look like and they, they all have a different type of feel so there's like really light snow you can see right there or a severe thunderstorm like I was showing you earlier or hail mostly cloudy I mean it just looks really cool so you can see the stars up here and we'll go to a blizzard in the night so you can see very uh, violent blizzard going on right there If we go back here and go into the daily conditions you can see kind of the difference if we look at these so you can see it's a little brighter than it was on the uh, the night one and we'll go down here to we'll try hurricane so you can see the leaves blowing right there as well as some uh, water spray going on. Let's scroll down here to, let's do freezing rain. Let me see what that looks like. And we'll do frigid, see what that looks like. So basically this just looks cold. <laughs> I mean, not much going on in, in terms of dynamic. It looks like maybe the sun ray right there is gonna be moving a little bit, but other than that, not too much going on. And there's sleet, but there are some really cool uh, wallpapers in this, but one thing to mention is, first of all, battery life. So battery life is going to be something to consider if you install this tweak. It definitely can uh, take a drain on your battery. I haven't really messed with it a whole lot in order to give you a precise estimation of how much more battery it's taking, but I can guarantee you that dynamic wallpapers like this are going to take a considerable amount of battery. Now, one more thing to mention is the status bar so you can see not too much wrong up here but if you look right here at the battery percentage you can see that there's actually a uh, Bluetooth symbol behind that status bar so that's a little jacked up also if we go to the lock screen then you're basically gonna see two different status bars and it's really jacked up so that's something that hopefully will be fixed in a future update by the developer but right now that's what you have to deal with if you purchase this right now but other than the status bar bug, as well as the taking a little bit more battery issue, I think this is a really cool tweak. So let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. Also, don't forget to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter for updates. And if you haven't checked out my gaming channel, go over there and stop by and say hey. All right, guys. Until next time. Peace.